Hey guys, welcome back to an all new episode of Conflicts. Today we're looking at an all new budget projector. This here is the Vanco Performance V700W, a 1080p full HD projector aligned to go ahead and get that nice HD quality look as well as sound with Adobe Audio. Now, this particular unit is currently on the market, so if you guys want your very own, check out the link down below in the description. And in this episode here, we'll be unboxing it as well as trying it out and seeing exactly how it performs. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. All right, so this here is our packaging. This here is our box kind of showcases the product of course. Uh, so it can go up to 120 inches, so that's kind of cool. And it says it is included. So that is neat that they do include a projector screen, so you don't have to worry about that in terms of purchasing it. Now, uh, as you kind of rotate it about, it talks about what's in it. And then that is about it. Oh, here we go, we got some performance. So this features an LCD display, uh, resolution of 920 over 1080, can be installed on front, rear, or ceiling. Has a manual slash electronic focus. Uh, uh, it says a 5 watt 4 OHM and that's times 2 for speakers. Uh, and then you have different formats of the photos that it can recognize as well as video. So you can go ahead and plug a USB in there and just kind of recognize videos and play off of that. Uh, use a mounting screw of M4 metric and LED for its light source. And then that is about it. Okay, let's open it up. All right. Okay, so it looks like we have our projector screen in here. Now this is 120 inches, it's nicely folded. Uh, it does come with, looks like some clips for mounting port purposes. So that is nice that that is actually included with that. Uh, over here, it looks like we have an accessory box. So our accessory packaging will include a variety of different things, including cleaning materials as already noted. Uh, so one thing is we get our power care cord. Uh, looks like we have some cleaning wipes. Uh, so this is a nice cloth like material then it also comes with q-tips for that finer detail uh, You get your remote and it does actually come with an HDMI cable. So that is also pretty neat that they do include that uh, user manual and this here is our projector. So overall, a pretty standard looking projector. I do like the fact that it's round, so it does have nice curved edges. Uh, you have some manual toggle controls here on the top. You have your power button, you have your back button. Uh, on the rear side here, you do see your different ports. So you do get an aux out port, two HDMIs, two USBs, as well as your on off toggle switch with the power cable ports. Now on the bottom here, you do have rubber stoppers, and then you also have essentially these M4 ports to go ahead and mount screws to essentially, if you're mounting it on the ceiling. Now it also comes with this adjuster here, so if you wanna go ahead and have it done tilt, uh, you can go ahead and pop that out as much as you like. Now on the front side here, you do have your infrared sensor port, so this will be for the remote, of course, uh, and then you have your case right here, so essentially a cover uh, for the projector actual light source too. Now I believe the speakers are gonna be on the sides here and yeah, that is that in a nutshell. Uh, so let's go ahead and quickly boot this thing up next and try it out. Okay, go ahead and turn this on and then put the power button. You do have a blue LED ring on the top, so that's nice that it's included. All right, so this here's our main menu. Uh, so you have movie, music, photo, and text. Now, this doesn't have anything other than directly plugging something in to make it work, but that's the only way you can play it in terms of videos go. All right, we're gonna go ahead and try this out. Uh, we're gonna be playing PlayStation. Surprisingly, the sound's actually pretty good on this. It sounds really like surround sound, and I think it's really nice. So let's just go ahead and just try a Hot Wheels Unleashed right here. Oh my God. Yeah, it sounds actually really, really good. And for something that's 1080, this thing's actually really crisp quality. You can tell right away how it looks, and that's actually really phenomenal. So this thing does create a lot of heat, is my only complaint so far. Uh, but it is working quite well. You can see the quality of the screen is actually very, very crisp. I mean, it's handling it very, very well. Uh, and surprisingly, the quality of the graphics are really, really good on this, especially on a screen like this. And yeah, I mean, even for 1080p, I have to say, they did a great job with it. It's actually a good gaming projector, than nonetheless. I would highly recommend it, especially if you're looking for something that's on a budget. This is definitely a great way to go. 
Uh, granted that, you know, it's not 4K, but still, I mean, depending on the size that you're doing it, at this size, I think we're about like 60 plus inches, it's still pretty good. And yeah, I mean, <laughs> it's actually a blast. Oh! <laughs> Oh, that was so unnecessary, wasn't it? Yes, it was. Oh my god! Alright, we gotta finish this. Alright, well there you guys have it. Overall, a great projector. Definitely cool to use, especially if you're looking for something on a budget. I would highly recommend it. Now, other than that, if you guys have any questions about it, feel free to comment down below. Otherwise, see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye-bye.